Today we're gonna make a quick and powerful money spell that is gonna work fast. If you want to work for prosperity, abundance, wealth, money, success, the best timing to do this type of work is during the waxing moon and during days of Sunday and Thursday, during the planetary hours of the Sun and the Jupiter. The links that might be helpful I'm gonna leave them in the description below. When we're preparing spells, we need to prepare the space for them, which means cleaning and cleansing and raising the vibrations of the environment. I'm gonna use Palo Santo for cleansing. First I'm gonna cleanse myself, my working space, and leave this beautiful scent to cleanse the rest. For this spell we're gonna need an empty jar, a little jar, it needs to have a lid. Now I'm gonna quickly talk about all of the ingredients that I have prepared. First, this is a little pyrite piece that is called the Fool's Gold. It's great for abundance and money work, so I'm gonna leave it here. Secondly, we have a little piece of gold that used to be my golden earring, but it broke. It's perfect for adding extra boost. The third ingredient I'm gonna use the basil. This is a purple basil. Purple is the color of the Jupiter and it's just something I grow in my garden, so I'm gonna use it. The next one we have chamomile. It's perfectly fine to use the tea bugs. Another magical ingredient is a cinnamon stick. It can be a cinnamon powder as well. Another tea bug of mint. Peppermint is great for money spells. The next two ingredients are two little cloves and a piece of ginger. All of these ingredients together with cinnamon are corresponding to fire, which is gonna make this spell working quicker and bringing faster results. These are the fire elements. The last piece is the carob, which is growing in the Mediterranean region. And traditionally it is said that the seeds of carob are bringing prosperity and you can put them in your wallet or purse to bring prosperity. If you don't have carob, you can substitute it for another prosperity ingredients or find the carob powder in the health store. So what we need is two seeds, two is the number of completion. So I'm using two cloves and two carob seeds. So that's from all of the ingredients. Together we have eight of them. Eight is a number for prosperity and abundance and money, so that's why I'm using it. Any extra ingredients that you will need is the wax. I have these pieces left over from my candles, the yellow one and the little green one that is probably a mix of different wax colors, so I'm gonna use them for sealing. I have some golden yellow cord and yellow golden beads that I'm gonna wrap around when I finish. Additionally, we will write a petition, so we need a piece of brown paper and green and golden colors for writing, because they correspond with our intention. We're gonna need more Palo Santo to smoke, cleanse everything. And the jar and all of the ingredients. If you don't have some of these ingredients that I mentioned, you can check the description for some great book resources for finding different correspondences. Before we start, I'm gonna talk a little bit about intention. It is said that intention for petitions should be written on a brown paper that is not cut but seared, should be specific and should be in the present tense, should be measurable, something like setting goals. So for example, by the end of October 2021, I'm on uh, have three thousand dollars in my account. It's specific, it's measurable, it has a date. A couple of things you can do with a petition. You can for example write the symbols like dollar symbol or create the sigil. Let's let's tell this is our sigil that represents this specific intention. Write it on this little piece of paper that will be our petition. Sigil, that's the different currency I want to attract. And now we're gonna charge it with the golden color and make little hearts that we love having this 
many around piece of golden string fold the petition in towards us so it brings the money make two knots on it gonna put some chamomile not too much some mint now we're gonna drop in the petition our intention i charged little pieces of pyrite and gold a little bit of ginger i don't usually recommend using fresh ingredients but we're gonna use a little bit two cloves two little carob seeds a little bit of basil and the last ingredients that also gonna make this spell go fast is a bit of cinnamon that's how the little spell looks like there's our petition little pieces of corresponding herbs and crystals and metals now we're ready to charge it first we're gonna close it hold it in our hands in this moment you can feel yourself being abandoned having financial prosperity being uh, able to support your life and the lives of others visualize and imagine all of these good good feelings of money that will allow you to do good in the world when we charge this one it's time to seal it I'm gonna need a lighter for it so I'm just gonna drip a little bit of wax on it a little bit of screen I like to seal all the sides equally be careful when you work with wax and fire so as you can see it's getting nicely sealed and we're gonna prepare a little charm for that i'm gonna use this golden string eight little bits and put them through the thread if you enjoy this type of content let me know what else would you like to see and make sure to like subscribe visit my blog for more info about witchcraft and magic i would also be really honored to have you in my patreon group where i upload grimoire print pools each month so if there's something that you want to include in your book of shadows feel free to check it out for the ending note we're gonna make this little spell jar finish with our charm gonna put it around to bring this beautiful gold energy and make two knots voila our little spell jar How do you like it? <laughs>